guys and welcome. We have here some new new news about Finn and Becky. Becky support scare fan drama and free comparison uh, released two hours ago. Please don't forget to go support the original channel, like, subscribe, share, leave a comment. Uh, the link is gonna be in the description box below. Now, without further ado, let's check out the news. Hey guys, welcome back to BL World Drama. You are got to source for the juiciest scandals in the world of BL and GLs. From trending hashtags to sizzling social media drama, I've got it all. Join me as I dive deep into the lives of your favorite stars with exclusive updates, secrets, and interviews that will keep you hooked. Subscribe now, ring the bell, and let's dive into the glitz, the glam, and the scandalous world of BL and GLs. So let's get right into it. So today was Becky's, or yesterday. She left yesterday for a trip to Paris. She will be attending like... I think the El Oriel like factory to see how things are done and all that. Like she has been invited by El Oriel to Paris. I'm not really sure on the specifics of what she is going to do there. So when she got to the airport today, like there were a lot of fans who were there to receive her, and it ended up to be a whole mess. The information that I am getting that I'm not a hundred percent certain on is that Becky, like someone tried to give Becky a gift that allegedly some shippers were not okay with and like they threw like the gift down and that person that beast became angry and like was aggravated and like what started flying back and forth that did make like becky feel like uncomfortable so it was a whole situation and they were pretty like close to her and like close to becky and it actually made her unsafe and like fans were pretty upset because i think the only person that was with becky was Pichen, and there wasn't any security they didn't have any security they didn't uh as far as i have heard there was Pichen and bebop so two people didn't have, like any like airport staff to actually protect them and all that because we don't know like with other ag agencies they do have security beforehand or like they do talk to the airport and this airport people like they offer like some airport security people to like follow like these actors until they're out of the airport but idol factory didn't do that i could only see Pichen with becky so like fans are now upset and they want like idol factory to do better and like to have security and to like actually protect like the girls and protect becky but now this whole event was like turned around and the focus was no longer on protecting becky because like some shippers decided to say that if Becky was, if friend was with Becky, this wouldn't have happened. So now Becky stands are upset because now they feel like they are taking the attention out of Becky and they are making Becky like look weak. And it's only friend that can protect Becky. And like, okay, okay. so she was weak. In that situation, she was weak. What is wrong on this? That, and that it wouldn't happen if Freen was there, as in Freen would protect her, or as in her whole presence would not split again the fan dom and or fan base, and they would stick together as the, it was in the past. I don't. Okay, so in the case of if Freen was there, it wouldn't happen. I don't understand what is the, the argument here. In case of f making Becky seem weak, yes, she was weak. And sh there should have been someone who protects her. It's not like it, there shouldn't be someone. So I would say both she was weak and they failed to protect her properly. And it's one does not exclude the other, you know. Like there is a back and forth. I know people are have completely forgotten about like not completely but they are forgetting about what the most important issue is and the most important is issue is how dark the BL and GL industry is getting. Uh what? Uh I have okay. So this incident that would have happened no matter who would or wouldn't be there. Uh it uh, Using this as an argument for how jo girl love and boy love industry always was and always is going to be toxic is not really very cool to do because it's it's using current situation to prove a point while in reality it was always toxic, it is toxic and it is always going to be toxic. 
because of its nature. So it is definitely not the most important issue. It is, it, it is not. It is a constant issue that is there and that people are using in their advantage. Sometimes it turns against them and some people might end badly for that reason and some might be very, uh, and even unjustifiably so, uh, glorified for it. But, but, but that, that is what it is. It's not that this is the most important issue. Like, from what point of view? Yes, of course, there are point of views where you can say that it is more important than what happened to Becky, or if Freen was with her or not, and if it wouldn't happen or not. Of course, from general point of view, that is the most important issue. But then again, that issue was always present, and even when people who are entering the industry uh, are entering it, they know about this. They fucking know about it, so yeah, it is and it isn't important. Like fans are getting like... Basically, they are trying to build their success, fame and glory on it. They try to use it and direct it for their advantage. That they are not going to be successful is another story completely. Extremely, extremely toxic and extremely, extremely crazy. Mm. and like they no longer know like what lines not to cross eh, no 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 we are here substituting causes and effects they it is not they no longer know like what like lines to cross they never knew check out all of the previous sources of information about all of the boy love girl love genre couples on screen Check out cases of signed and perf for Christ's sake. Check out. Uh, what did I say? Okay, Z Saint. Uh, check out. But yeah, like Saint Art. Uh, check out uh, Mew Golf. Check out whoever is there. It's all the same story all over again create cost and um, maximize by fans and that is what you enter if you decide to do this that is what you decide to play that game uh, there are professionals who enter it and count on it and tries to be very professional during their uh, stay at the industry but I mean come on cross and what lanes to cross like, the whole thing is all blood, and they do feel like this whole entitlement, again, like, there are people that come to my comment section and like, act like they do know these actors personally, when at the end of the day, even in, out of acting, they are still acting, especially Thai. Okay, uh, okay, Be because this is kind of important, what I'm going to do is, uh, please, without... You know, I try to make you avoid this trap of illusion that it is only happening now. Check out channel uh, Moon Consort, which is uh, Kayla's channel. She has here beautiful critical uh, videos. Check out, let's start from the most favorite ones. Uh, yeah, it was perfect. Saint. Perfect Saint uh, and the drama. Saint is, by the way, producer of Idol Factory, which is the company that Efreen and Becky are under. Check out their case. It is on a whole new dimension of absolutely disgusting. Check out Mew and Art. Okay, it was Mew and Art. Their story? It's freaking impossible. And you will never know the beginning and the end of those stories. Never. Check out uh, the, the story of okay bible build should i even mention that i i'm not sure um check ah this is one of a good topic to check if you are interested into these things Wh why it is such a toxic environment to begin with uh check out the story of uh where were they where were they by the way, it's exactly the story of uh, um, of 
characters that portrayed Bill and Sang, Billy and Sang uh, for I, um, for War of Y. This is exactly the same case uh, that we are solving now for Freed and Becky or all of the other ones. Um, who was next? Who was next? I reacted, by the way, to uh, Saint and Perf, Saint and Z, uh, Mu and Art, Mu and Gulf situations. Those are four. Kim Porsche, aka a Bible Belt. I'm not sure. I referred to. Yeah, I, I think I did react to it, but only like. Um, about this. Like, only very, very narrow, narrowly. Uh, ch ch check out the drama around Chris, please. Check out. Uh, outfits. Uh huh. I mean, and Moon, Moon, Moon like Kayla is only one of those who actually work on these type of topics. So if you are interested, I would really, 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 really recommend to you to check out her channel because she really knows what she's talking about. She gives you um, perspectives as well. I try to add some new perspective to it too, but she hit the nail. She hit the nail. Uh, so, to begin with, all of this industry is built on such cases. It's not that it is happening only now. Okay? Fine. Out of acting, they are still acting. Especially Thai, GL and VL actors are pretty good actors. They act. Mm-mm, mm-mm. But their industry is well pre preparing them well for fun servants that comes with promotion. That is what they can do. And that is what they do maximally. But if you check out promotional stuff for Taiwanese series, Japanese series, a Korean series, you will find exactly the same. But they are way more toned down uh, doing that for their their culture and their society being way more against what is going on in comparison to Thailand. Okay? It's it's not that they, the Thai actors are so great. Some of them are great, of course. N most of them are just, just handsome people or beautiful people who were trained for three months or how long to, to, to act and they think they know it all while they want to earn as much money as possible, which is understandable because this is exactly the approach that is open in Thailand, but then they, then they very um, early on uh, hit the wall between people who actually know about these things a little bit more than just watching beautiful bodies and faces. And they, 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 they have many things to say about quality of these projects, and what should be improved. And believe me, there is many things to be improved about acting of Thailand actors. No matter how good they are, those young ones at least, mm -mm, still not yet there. A and they, they, like, I mean, the, the, the sources are out there. They can improve the thing that they don't want to, or they don't dedicate time to, or that they have better plans in life and they just earn want to earn money, it's in our disadvantage, maybe even in, in disadvantage of them, and you can't do much about it. We, we still have to be grateful for those projects being created, because b before them, no one would be willing to. And I am grateful. That, that is what I am. I am grateful for someone being willing to portray characters on screen that are of a different orientation that is the general population. But... But it has its disadvantage, of course. It, it has to have, considering how they came to act. That's natural. Like, the whole time, whenever they are in front of, like, cameras, they are acting, like, 90% of the time. And for you to feel like you do know them, they are, I'm not saying all of them, but they are, like, I think, 90 I am not feeling it. All of them. All of them do this because the competition is pretty high now. The competition is so up, they are forced to do it. So all of them do fan service. Even if you say that some of them 
are real couple in real life, they are married and stuff, they still do fan service. I can guarantee you that. Six percent of them, like act a hundred percent of the time when the camera is on them. Uh, all of them do it to a certain degree, to a certain point, depending on how good they are, how what uh, where the answer from public, uh, f depending on what are their life goals as well. So yeah, and it's a thing of prestige for them all of a sudden it's uh, their personal thing because they want to succeed right and it did you know this, this is what is so twisted about it they did didn't don't they no longer even have to be ordered to do so they do it willingly because they know how high the stakes are so don't act like you do know them personal because you don't now this friend issue and all that did I agree uh, with uh, the channel on you don't know them at all so you you can't pretend you do like you can but then you are gonna run into situation of free and saying when all of a sudden you realize you don't and it's your mistake and your fault for not knowing better because they never did more than they were paid for fun servicing they are paid for Directly or indirectly uh, acting they are paid for they need to learn skills for doing those But they are paid for it. They do what they are supposed to what society expects from them They are earning money for themselves and their families. They can take care of themselves financially. I like you So you see You see but, and then pretending like if when was there like Becky would have been safe and all that happened wouldn't have happened it would have been much worse because the crowd would have doubled or even tripled maybe because as i am looking i don't i feel like people um, we don't know what would happen if Rin was there but this this is except this is actually one of those um options the possibilities that are there it would it, it could have made things worse because of how people are angry at her or because so many people are hyped about her too, d doubling the, the effect of Ofrin and Becky together uh, there. Um, would she be able to take care of Becky? I will give her in the past, she did many deeds that proved that she's really doing nothing if not taking care of Becky, even in terms of safety and in terms of like basic um, primary needs that's true uh that does not equal into her being able to save and protect her from this approach because this approach would be aimed at her and free too you know we don't know what would happen we still do love them together like even like this few days and as well they are angry at them together and as well they are most more angry at free and then and back it so we don't know if the situation wouldn't get worse you know i've been seeing that friends comments are filled with love and all that so it's like this whole issue has died down and has died out and people are back to like shipping normally and yeah people are back to loving them normally like the people who are left have left and like there is just a few people who like are hating very few but people have chosen like to love them have become solo stands or people have like gotten over the whole issue because of this everyday new information coming out that She's probably not in a relationship with Seng and these big accounts are making it seem like she is in a relationship with Becky. So people are back to shipping. So that number would have definitely tripled or even doubled. So how would have how would friend handle all that? So the most important issue is like and I liked that I hear like some fans were calling other fans out and that is very important for like us to do and for people to do. And also I hear that like at least like airport security like got in and made sure they fused the situation which is also good but also idol factory should be able to take like charge and make sure that next time this doesn't happen again if they can't hire like personal like professional security bodyguard they should at least talk to the airport or they should make an arrangement with the airline if the airline can't talk to the airport and actually explain this whole thing 
so that they can do they can get like airport security because i'm sure i agree they should have done this at least but they can't be given airport security if they ask either for an additional charge or for I mean, it would be in their a disadvantage if they weren't, be, uh, if they wouldn't be able to provide some type of security on airports. Come on, there is no way they don't have their means towards this because it would be in their disadvantage after all if something happened there because of this. They cannot afford it, so they would help them. You know, this is just making people angry for a reason. I'm sure they can't be given airport security if they ask either for an additional charge or for free, and. Again, imagine something would really happen there. Do you think that the airport wants to deal with that, the aftermath of something happening? No, the heck. They want to be prepared. They themselves need to be prepared for something like this. That they, something might happen, something might occur. So they are the first ones that would have, it would be in their advantage to, to, to know in advance and to deal with it timely. Yeah, and fans also should be actually be very careful on what they do and how like they do true, like come true. close to these actors if true you mm. don't have and all this gift giving like when you meet like the actor you decide to give the gift like then and then it's not right because actually if these actors do go to like your countries i think they should start making like a day whereby or a place whereby like all their fans can drop their gifts and then someone from their team can go pick those gifts and then take them to the actor so it becomes much easier other than everyone trying to hand over what they have because i know custom charges can be a b and when you actually want to give like the person you like a gift you can't because of the charges and the shipping costs so it is i i did it is yeah like i understand the point of it it being even easier to do it like this instead of sending it anywhere i get it i get it i understand but still people like what people are doing that they are not educating themselves people should already know that this is from security's point of view so dangerous and even those who mean well come on fuck up your fucking intentions of good being good do goers good doers you know what i mean uh fuck it they they do it for you and then imagine then then for people's pressure of her ex accepting your gift specifically she is forced into accepting everyone's gift and in one of those gifts being really something dangerous would you really wish her that fate just because you couldn't fuck with your presence like come on this is so selfish approach it's actually good if like these actors can come up with a way or a place whereby if they do visit a country, like they do tell fans beforehand that we will don't come with gifts or anything, don't try to hand us anything, we will give like a location whereby you can give us like these things. So it will get much easier. Like communications, coordinations and proper planning can help like diffuse and stop all these things that have been happening to actors. So so if you do like see the back and forth, this is this is what it's all about. It's about like friend stands or I don't know, shippers claiming that it was really important for friend to be part of the trip and like they made a mistake not including her because uh, it wasn't i disagree with that statement if they did include her this whole thing wouldn't have happened so tell me in the comment section what you think about this whole thing do you think like the bl and gl in the fandom is getting like really toxic i'm going to do a video i don't think it is getting a toxic i think it already was toxic it started as a toxic, it's continuing as toxic, and it is going to end as toxic. About it, I have been collecting informations for like some time now, and I'm going to do a whole video on how dark and toxic like the BL and Gel fandom has become. So tell me in the comment section what you think about this whole thing. So if you haven't subscribed, subscribe, turn on the post notification, give me a thumbs up, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. You know what would be really cool? Some comparison research of... God. If there actually happened to be some shift in uh, level of dangerousness in the industry and if it really changed in some way or if it is all the same and other psychological uh, effects work on people's minds because like I, I know I claim it's all the same but uh, I am more like meaning the existence of toxicity was present there still and i still feel like the situation with freeman back is so really 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 on the mildest level 
so far in comparison to what happened to Sane and Perth or what happened to Sane and Z or what happened to uh, Art and Mew and and Mew and Gav, you know, like uh, 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 maybe not Mew and Gav, but I believe like these, these toxic traits just happens to be present all the time, all the way through and through this whole, whole existence of, of entertainment business, um, industry, like this specific field of it, and this specific branch of it. Uh, and in that, it is still the same, nothing changes. Okay, uh, let's check out some comments um, that were under the video. Uh, so one of them states, what anger, I wonder if that... Uh, uh, I wonder, is that uh, the security uh, that the company offers for an idol like Becky horrible, that scheme and very poor, they could have easily hurt her because she wasn't truly protected. I mean, she wasn't protected even by fans who could have protected her by not giving her the gifts in the way that was not previously agreed on and specified. I don't understand why there isn't a security guard to protect Becky. Becky is very scared about what these people are. Because it costs money, darling. That is why it isn't there. And maybe for some other shady reasons I, I don't... That cannot... That don't come into my mind right now. But still, c c kinda for the same reasons. Money. Uh, how would Freen stopped it from happening? These shippers are saying things now. What a mess. Uh, I feel like they were, mm, they were, um, you know, they were pointing at uh, her previously in the past, saving and protecting Becky from harm, physical harm, like the shield that was falling on both of them. She was the one who was able to jump out and protect both her herself and Becky from getting hurt. As well, the stairs, the fact, like, I know several artists from here who, after falling stairs, died in my country. My country is really small, it's not really that... But it happens, and especially stars should be careful about stairs, because it is... Mm, mm, no, stages and stairs are really freaking dangerous. Um, so, the, the stairs thing, I very much count. I can't even express myself how much I count her helping her, Becky, at stairs. Yeah, I mean the shield, the stairs, and multiple other occasions where she just showed how... Um, she knows, she knows what is really important and what is not that much important while doing all of this and I appreciate her for this so uh, this is how would Freen probably uh, help in people's minds she would be there she would know what to do she would know where to move aside or how to calm the fan that is what she could be able to do because she has some experiences in comparison to Becky and Becky is still probably uh, being perceived as the young little stupid girl who cannot protect herself and cannot do something on her own and, and to, to a certain degree she still is because she's young uh, and Finn is still young too but she still has more experience and is a little bit older than her so actually those three years or four years it counts at their age thank god everything turned out well and it did not go uh, on to greater con congratulations by blessing in Paris okay Okay. Uh, be uh, before we blame anyone, we need to think and study about the security poli uh, policy specifically outside the country. Only to ask why the even who invite Becky not prepared and assigned a personnel to provide security, uh, security and safety of the artists who they invite the, uh, to go there uh, to their event. I am not sure what is the standard way of doing things. If it is that they are gonna provide only someone for protection in cases that those people are in danger, then that would be it. If it is like a normal standard way that they are being protected by someone, then that is it. Uh, if it isn't, then they are not gonna be there and that is it. 
Uh, maybe they counted on Becky being not so popular in Paris, so they hoped that their her flight would be way more calmer in comparison to her own country or Asia, which is a valid point. I mean, those of us who are not watching this series have has no way how to know Becky. So most no believe whatever you wish to, but. Mm, j- <sighs> most part of this planet that is um, that li- that the humankind lives on does not know who Becky is. Most of us, most of people, does not know who Becky is. So why should they count on that their her flight is not gonna be safe if she's not gonna be uh, a priori beforehand if she that she's not gonna be protected? Like wow. <laughs> You know, uh, that's their obligation. I'm not sure what is their obligation, truth be told. I don't know how it is in artists in from America, Asia, a- uh, Africa, Europe. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, not too direct to Idol Factory. Uh, if Idol Factory had a security to back it together here in Paris, need to uh, offer it and cooperate uh, the Paris government. Okay, so then let's agree on that the company who is uh, hiring her is gonna secure her safety, which is fine, which is perfect. But still, the people who should be taking care of that, making sure that it happens, is Isle Factory, not the organization that is uh, inviting her, because they don't know how popular... They do know how popular they are, you know, but... They don't know, they don't have to know specifically, because, like, really seriously, I can't imagine that friends of all countries is really digging into all of this stuff that is going on in in Asia right now. And that includes the fiasco with Freen and Seng. So how, why would they count on there is a problem when they are hiring basically an artist who they know is popular in Asia? What should be do- they doing? It's not their responsibility. It's Idol's factory responsibility to tell we have here this and this problem or we need, we require, we want to for this and this artist some security. Please secure it. We will do it. We can't do it right now because it's your government and stuff. We don't know the legislation there. Please provide a security for her. She's gonna need it. But they need to say them. They, they need to tell them this. Otherwise... It's not gonna work, you know. They need to come with th- this thing out. So, <sighs> cooperate uh, in uh, Paris. Because if you said security, only a criminal need bodyguard in times in need to transfer d- to the place. What? Only a criminal need bodyguard in times need to transfer to the place they involve the crime. No, 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 no. Bodyguards are protectors of someone who hires them, like celebrities. The people who are securing criminals who go from prison to prison, for example, those are people from army or people from police forces. They are not the same. Bodyguards, I believe, does not strictly necessarily have to be policemen, but people who are securing criminals have to be. It's a difference to transfer to the place they involve the crime. But for... Uh, need to transfer to the place they involve the crime. Uh, but for Becky, like, this is only the said event who invite Becky... Uh, did you see Bodyguard? Like, what am I even explaining here? The fa- but, but for Becky, like, this is only the said even who invite Becky is their obligation to provide the people that they can get and make sure their invites uh, delegates to er- are safe. Uh, especially like the artists and popular artists, because sometimes there is more people making a drama like that. Yes, exactly. There are definitely fans who are creating drama and are very uh, famous personality. But, but the, again, Fra- France of all countries is prepared for something like this. With all of the film festivals and stuff, I can guarantee you they know how to do their shit. So why no one forewarned them that they need to do this for Becky, is my question. Idol Factory, hello there. Now blame the Paris who invite Becky on that said even. No, 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 I wouldn't. 
it's both sided. One can ask if they don't need it, and one should come with first telling we need it because they know that uh, as of now for Flynn and Becky they need it. Not Idol Factory. Uh, what blame the Paris to? Uh, no, why not? I, I like. W w are you a protector of, of Idol Factory or what? Why not Idol Factory? The Idol Factory is the parent of their kids. They know what is necessary, what is causing problems currently with the artists. If for no, not for anything else, because they are scared of what happens to Freen. It, it Alvaid Becky should be indirectly. So they should secure all of the fucking dramas about them hiring a lawyer for their cases and how they are gonna catch that person who is from a uh, uh, foreign country. How they cannot do it because he's from foreign country. And how they are basically still doing nothing but they are kind of packing it in a big uh, papers that are very col colorful for people for some reasons I don't understand because it, it is just not working and this is the proof it is not working and they still attempt to color it how it is not colored at all and so uh, in pa pa Paris like France should ask if it is not necessary or what and and Idol Factory should be the one, the first ones who tell, yes, but we know we have these and these problems, we need them, please help us, we need to guard them. Okay, uh, because that is outside Thailand. What? Okay, okay. So then the problem is cultural. Because I believe the whole Europe would solve the issue like this. We are sending you an artist that is problematic, even even if potentially only. Help us with the security if we cannot uh, secure her herself, ourselves. We we can se we can secure her the proper uh, guard. Please help us with that. And the other side would uh, would ideally ask, do you need it or not? If not, we have better things to do and better sources how to waste money. So we are not gonna provide you anyone, and uh, if you need it, we are gonna secure it because uh, we know how it works here, and you don't because it's not Thailand as you mentioned. But if Asia is used to the who is inviting, is gonna take all of the responsibility and is gonna secure the safety of artists, then fine. But then if we run into a mistake or misunderstanding or misinterpretation of cultures. And it is absolutely on cultural le culture level. It should not happen again. But still, we saw that here is the flaw and we should fix it. And we have to start somewhere. So yes, like for Europe or America, if you invite artists from Asia, you need to be prepared to ask first if this is necessary or not. If uh, um, Asia is doing the stuff, it differently than fine. <sighs> Okay, uh, invite uh, to, uh, not Idol Factory because it is outside Thailand and not there under cost, custody. Uh, 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 probably custody. Only blame that the host who invite Becky, the, their obligations to secure Becky. Don't blame Idol Factory when she went to Brazil, security was there and they were more uh, people at the airport. Uh, that's interesting point, then it would, okay, that is interesting point. Again, I don't know how it was in case of Brazil. I don't know how big fan base is in Brazil in comparison to France. France. I am not sure why it was there. If it was initiative of fans, then it would make sense. If it was something that Brazil does like that on a normal basis, then it would be understandable. If it is more uh, than a cultural thing, stuff between how South and... Uh, North does things, then it's again like it's a misunderstanding. But you cannot, if I were Idol Factory or if I were to um, secure safety of artists in general, I can't expect that every country and every culture is gonna do the, sa the stuff about protection the same. But the heck, you want to tell me that these companies have no experiences whatsoever previous to Becky's arrival to Paris. I don't believe that. Like, something happened, but I don't believe what's going on in the comment sections or between fans. 
because that is all a whole of a crap of nonsenses. <sighs> My, I got angry again. Uh, guys, your thoughts, opinions, ideas, let us know. I am really interested in those. For now, have a great day. Stay tuned. Stay awesome as you already are. And bye-bye for now.